So in Newfoundland, the cod is king. Of course, every time we refer to fish in Newfoundland, we all know we mean cod. We use the tongue of the cod, and today I'm gonna to make some cod tongues with some pork scrunchions, which is uh, rendered out pork fat. And then we're gonna take the lovely cod and we're gonna form them into cod cakes. So cook up the potato. I've used some leeks in this recipe and put feta cheese in with the cod just to bring back the salt cod because traditionally these will be made with salt codfish as opposed to fresh cod. Just dredge it in some flour and then you pan fry it until golden brown. Traditionally we serve it with a, a mustard relish which is a homemade relish of peppers, onions and some mustard seed and cucumber. Okay, so you just bring your pan to medium there and cook your cod uh, cakes up. When they're nice and golden brown, you take them off and, and serve them up with um, a nice broccoli or side salad or something like that. Of course, then we have this um, cod tongue. People always ask us if, if we actually use the real tongue of the cod, and of course we do use the tongue of the cod, and it's a real delicacy here in Newfoundland. And all we simply do is dredge this in some flour, and then we pan fry it with um, some pork scrunchions. So, pork scrunchions is just raw, uh, the fat back of the, of the pork, of the uh, pig, and what we do is we render these out. We use this in a lot of dishes in Newfoundland. It's, it's uh, the base of a lot of um, uh, casseroles and uh, any fish dish. The cod tongue itself has a little bit of uh, um, like a jelly uh, feel to it, so we like to fry them nice and crispy to give them a nice crispy outside. You cook the cod tongues until you come to a nice golden brown. So they're coming on close to being finished there now. Turn over my cod cake. Oh yeah. So these are really easy, same thing. You just want to cook these until they're nice and golden brown. The fluffy warm potato in here with the leeks the buttered leeks and the, like I said, the salty feta with the cod. It's a really nice uh, traditional dish. So as you can see, these cod cakes didn't take very long to cook up. Newfoundland, you know, has always been around the 100 mile diet, mostly because of isolation. Because we are an island, certainly we had to become self-sufficient. We live off the sea and off the land. And most things that we do eat traditionally are, you know, anything to do with the codfish and any rabbit, wild game, moose, of course, um, caribou from Labrador, and root vegetables are also very, um, very much a staple of our diet. Cod, of course, is the biggest part of our staple of that. These cod tongues are nicely done. Of course, you can make these dishes at home, but there's no one more special than coming to Newfoundland and visiting us and enjoying these delicacies in our restaurants.